corner and Westburn Grant Frost has held them up as they corner. He leads by a length on Sinbad Bay. Over on the inside, Thor 8 tight connection to Foe and Almeida Boy. But Westburn Grant has kicked halfway down the straight. Vicky Frost said go and Westburn Grant starts to come away. Westburn Grant's too good for them. Oh, it's tight the Miracle second. Mile is the country's leading harness racing event of the year. To be first past the post, both driver and horse must have a special partnership. Westburn Grant and trainer driver Vic Frost have dominated the mile for the past two years, but this year will be their ultimate challenge. I'm never overconfident uh, of uh, like horse racing. I mean, anything can happen. Um, you've got um, five other horses in there which are uh, almost equal in ability. Um, the draw is, plays a, a great part and uh, the early part of the race, uh, you know, possibly can determine the outcome of the finish. The miracle of this mile for Frost and Westburn Grant started in Perth earlier this year with a freak training accident, shattering his near hind leg past and bone, an injury that looks certain to prematurely end his career. When it first happened, we thought, oh, gee, like, you know, we, we could lose him, you know, and... Uh, that was really, really upset us, of course, because he's, we treat him as one of the family. This is the section that sort of broke, and uh, they put the screws through this, this way. There's uh, three through that way, and there's one coming up from the, the back and sort of coming through to the inside. There's no signs of uh, any problems there now, and uh, the screws uh, are all sort of still tight. Um, you know, they, they can sometimes come a little bit loose uh, after a few months, but uh, they all seem to be pretty tight on this fella. The agonising months of hard work have paid off. Since the injury, Westburn Grant has been virtually unbeatable. His runs have been in record times, with the distinction of a world record. He knows he's good, this fella. <laughs> Most days, Vic can be found on the New South Wales South Coast beaches. The quiet surroundings perfect for training his million dollar champion. Andrew, it's... Uh... You know, to me, it's sort of, it's become a must, you know. He's, um, he's had these, uh, these troubled feet for quite a while, and uh, I, I, when I, every time I sort of bring him to the beach and work him on the beach, he, uh, he sort of improves on it. The horse loves the sand, and because of his injuries, it is regarded as a safer surface to train on than the tracks. But from his property near Mossvale, travel time to the beach takes up the majority of the day. Just a little bit a long way away from home, actually. Uh, you know, it takes us an hour and a half travelling to get here and <clears throat> an hour and a half to go home. So, you know, it uh, makes it a long day, really, just to work one horse. For the week coming into the $400,000 Miracle Mile, the defending champion will be based only minutes away from their training grounds, assuring Westburn Grant has the most relaxing preparation. Everything is just uh, all him now, um, you know, for this next uh, couple of weeks or 10 days. Uh, everything we do, everything we sort of think of is, is to help him to sort of be able to be in condition to win that race. what we had in mind for him, eh, <laughs> in the next couple of weeks. Frost is gunning for an unprecedented fourth mile. Two wins with Westburn Grant and a win in 1970 with Lucky Creed. Regardless of his experience, the drive to Sydney next Friday morning will be a nervous one. We'll probably run the race probably uh, 10,000 times as we're sort of driving, you know, from, from here to Harrell Park. You hope you've got everything right with your horse, like his shoes are right, his gear's right, his feed's right, he's, you've done everything you can possibly do to have him at his best and, uh, and you just hope for a, a good run and a, a clean run race. The six horse field has already been named for Friday's event. The best paces from Australia and New Zealand will be present. Despite a torrid 12 months, Westburn Grant will start as favourite. Frost believes his horse has the right ingredients to create history. He's got a lot of character, he's got a lot of, lot of heart. Um, he's, uh, he, and he likes to win. He, and and he, sort of, he knows himself that he is good. And he, he, he sort of, I, I feel that he, in his, he feels in his own mind that he, he can sort of beat sort of any horse. 
With only days to go, Vic Frost has a lot on his mind. One vision keeps reappearing. Westburn Grant. Westburn Grant away. The Pacing Cup is all over. Westburn Grant to the